Oh boy, are you all in for a huge, huge treat today. I have snuck behind the scenes of a dear friend, Angela Walters, Quilting is My Therapy, the midnight quilter herself. But before we even get started with today's video, which we're gonna actually shoot from the end to the beginning, it'll be fun for you, I promise. I gotta show you some of these beautiful quilts that are hanging on here in display before I even let you all meet Angela. Make sure you put this on. Right? When you have company over, you gotta clean it up. Right, you clean before the maid gets here? Yeah, I, I throw all the stuff on the floor because right. you can't see it on camera. Wait, did you just call me company? Yeah. Oh. When the friends come over. When the when friends the special, come over. When the special guests come over. Right. Whoa, is this an amazing experience for all of us? I'm a little speechless, I'm a little starstruck, but I'm also here with my good friend, Angela Walters. We are gonna make for all of you one of the most incredible behind the scenes videos ever because you are now dealing with two professional quilters that are also their own cinematographers. I like to think I have a skill with the camera. I like to think you have a skill with the camera and the sewing machine <laughs> as well. So we are actually gonna make this video like we often do. Mm -hmm. We're gonna start at the end and we're gonna take you all the way to the beginning of the video. Sounds like a good plan? I, I love it, I'm, I'm down for the journey. So Miss Angela Walters, where are we at today? You are in a place people have seen this part. This is my filming area. So this is where I do my live chats, my videos, my tutorials, Midnight Quilter, all this right here. But lest you think I'm really organized and all that, the rest of the room is not that organized. So as you swoop around, you're gonna see like all the other stuff, but oh, this is where- We can stop on the beautiful long yeah. arm. They still think it's organized. Yes, for sure. So this is where I do some videos on the long arm. But there's the rest of the room. Just so It's like my quilt studio. It's messy, right? But right? it's just how it needs to be. It takes a lot of equipment to make these videos come together, doesn't it? It does. And you know, quilters like toys. and videos are no different for sure. So this is kind of like my creative room when it comes to the videography side of it for the videos. This is really, really cool. Yeah, not many people get to come in here just because this part of the building isn't normally open to the public. Right. So Angela, I'm sorry. I always just assume everybody knows exactly who you are and what you're doing, but maybe we should start now kind of working towards the beginning portion that we can edit in at the end of this video. Please tell me and everybody at home, who are you and what are we doing here today? So my name is Angela Walters from Quilting is My Therapy and I know Rob Appel. That's my main claim to fame. Thumbs up. <laughs> Is that good? All right. All right. <laughs> now, I'm a machine quilting encourager and finisher, so I teach people how to machine quilt. I um, do a lot of other things, which you'll see here in a second, but my passion is machine quilting and helping other people love it as much as I do. Awesome. Awesome. So, we are in your downstairs filming studio. And there's a lot more down here if you want to see it. I do. Should you choose to see it? Uh, why don't I just follow you? Okay. Downstairs building, this is an old schoolhouse, and this is kind of where all the business happens. Okay, so this Ooh, is this our is quilting cool. room. This is where all the fabric gets cut for our video series, the kits that we sell with that. Um, we have a block of the month program. This is kind of where the people come and make me look good mm -hmm. with all the cutting. So, this is our mm -hmm. main cutting area. We do a block of the month called Build a Quilt, and Joni, who is our Build a Quilt foreman, or woman, um, is always busy in here. She's cutting up kits, so. Fun fact, I designed all those fabrics. All the fabrics you see in here I've designed. Wow. So Build a Quilt has three different colorways, three different fabric collections. This is the Holly Jolly. This is the Stroll colorway. And then over there is our Lux. These are wonderful designs. Well, thank you. You kind of have to say that now. But well, I want to go ahead and lead with that so that you don't come in here and be like, well, that's crap. You know, I'm like, well, right, hey. Right, right. This I is the worst it. design I've ever seen. You, you got to get that out early so that you don't in, right. inadvertently embarrass yourself. That's right. right. Well, that way I have both captures in case I need to edit in one or the other Perfect. at the beginning of this video. There you go. There you go. There you go. So anyway, this is where a lot of cutting gets done. Fantastic. And by the way, we are actually at Angela's event center right now. I guess I should just preface that. This is not the shop. We I are not at Quilting is My Therapy shop. We are at the event center so far. But remember, we're working our we're way to work the beginning of the video. There. All right, so down here is just where more businessy stuff happens. Our e-commerce fulfillment's down here. Of course, my filming, uh, machine repair, all that kind of stuff. This is really fun. And I always kind of say this is like my brain. So I can pop from room to room, just like different compartments. Oh, how's build a doing? How's the cutting doing? How's e-commerce? How's filming? Upstairs is where my office is and where we have our events. So do you want to see, see it? Here? I'd all love right. to. Let's go. All right, so up here is where we have our trunk shows, our, our build a quilt meetings. Um, we have retreat space and my office. And I'll show you my office first, but no judgment. No judgment. No judgment. <laughs> Actually, 
Um, this is where my director of operations is. This is her office. Ooh, very nice. So this used to be a schoolhouse, and my office is the old principal's office. <gasps> oh, you're now a principal too? You are getting sent to the principal's office. I am going to the principal's office. So this is my, my office. This is where I do all my editing, my creative work, emailing. Um, oh my I goodness. love it. It's so fun. And I picked up um, plant, dealing with plants during COVID, so that is- I was, It was so funny, I was just gonna, I'm looking past you, Angela, this is the sign of true happiness. Oh, look at Look at kidding? how happy your plants are. I know, and it's so, like, I love it, I love my plants. You're a good plant mom well, and a good quilter. The trick is to not have all your plants in one place, so nobody knows exactly how many you have. Oh. But so this is my office. I love your plants. <laughs> all right, so through here, this is not really anything big, this is our pop-up shop when we have events. Okay. Uh, but Pop. this, Let's see if you can fit through here. We're gonna go in the, the back way, but this is where I do our trunk shows, block of the month meetings. So it's really fun. I have groups come, especially before COVID, and I would do trunk shows here. Um, yeah, so this love this little place. It's always set up with super comfy chairs. I know what the quilters like. Right, and here's yeah. our wonderful lecture hall yeah. from this side. Finished is better than perfect. That's pretty much what I say the whole That's time. That's right. Yeah. All right, so there's that. The upstairs is basically the same as the downstairs, just different. Down there's kitchen, bathroom. And over here is our retreat room. So this is where we even have bigger groups, say for multi-day retreats. So I, I hold meetings with Rob Appel. Mm -hmm. And we also have clubs or groups. Oh, look, Angela, here's my office. Yeah. Right there. I was going to say, look at this nice bag kit I have right, right here. Right, right. <laughs> That's uh, the mobile so, office for the week? Yeah, yeah, so it's divided in two parts. You can show the other side. So it's kind of nice if I have a bigger group or a smaller group. So, lots of Very fun. inspiring. Yeah. And when we bought it, it was already redone. So all of the decor, all the paint you see was not me. So anyway, if you, th if you find it impressive, I didn't do it. Gotcha. But anyway, so this is where I spend most of my time. But if a quilter was going to come visit the shop, they probably wouldn't come here. They'd come to my shop in historic downtown Liberty. Ooh. Snap your fingers and take us there now. Ooh. Here we are. It is windy. We better get inside quick. This is exciting. We are getting an after hours tour. It's an exclusive shopping. Exclusive shopping experience yeah. for us here inside Quilting is My Therapy. And we are in Liberty, Missouri. Is that correct? That's correct. Historic downtown Liberty. This is really cool. Now, what was this wonderful building, Angela? It's been a lot of things through the years. It was built in 1868. It's on the historic register. Um, it, I don't know. It's been an antique store, I think, and also like an appliance store. Right. But for the last six years, it's been home of Quilting is My Therapy. Oh, it's just beautiful. Can you show us around a bit? Absolutely, absolutely. I have a great staff that does all the merchandising, all the ordering. They're fabulous. But we carry all the things you need to make a quilt. And um, I love the fill in here. I wanted it to not look like your regular quilt shop. So I just love the brick walls and the quilts hanging off of them. Mm-hmm. When we started the shop here, the idea was that I could bring my quilting machine from home and quilt in the back room, but it quickly took off and they're just, now my, my machine is still at home. Right. Um, but we sell a handy quilter long arm machine, so we have some of those set up, and then also the very back is kind of like our storage. So this is where the front end of the business is, all the retail components. Right. The fabric and all the things you need. I can't actually believe that you thought you were gonna be able to sit here in public and run a quilting machine without being slightly interrupted. Yeah, I, I, I guess it was silly now to think about it. Right, well we all have to have our dreams, right? <laughs> right. Um, this is, used to be the actual back of the building and it's been added on to since then. <laughs> so back here we just have some more machines. We offer machine quilting services, so Becky runs those for us during open hours and the back is just like another little Here's one of my favorite things. you want to see it? I do, of course. So this used to be some kind of shop that was called the Awesome Possum, and it's painted over the door. And so I left it up there because I just think it's too funny. The Awesome Possum. The Awesome Possum. 
This is fantastic. If I didn't already have quilting as my therapy as a name, I probably would have picked that. But right? Yeah, so I love the historic downtown area. Uh, the fact that we can have a shop that have restaurants and all the stuff around it. And I'm really excited because in June, June 18th, we're gonna have our annual quilt walk which is like our quilting show and tell where you can wander through the, the different participating businesses and pick up parts of a pattern I've designed especially for the, for, uh, the event. And first time ever, we're having a featured guest. Tula Pink will be what? here. What? Yeah, she's doing a trunk, sh not a trunk show, she's doing an exhibit and a demo and a book signing. And if you know, it's really hard to get Tula Pink to do any event. So if you're wanting to see her, this is the way to do it. So June 18th, Historic Downtown Liberty. We're only like 30 minutes from the Kansas City Airport and only 45 minutes from Missouri Star Quilt Company. Wow. So Rob, what are you doing in June? Boy, I don't know. Maybe I should get out here and have some serious fun yeah. with you ladies, huh? I think so. That it's going to be a good so time. That would be so much fun. Now, will there be quilts on display outside? There will and all be. Of that? What is yeah. a quilt walk? So every shop that's participating, they have a quilt displayed inside, because we're in Missouri. Yeah. We're not doing a quilt walk. We're not going to be outside in June. Right, right. Oh, and you can warm. wander through and look at the different quilts. We'll have a couple exhibits up. And then, like I said, I'll, I'll design an exclusive pattern for the quilt walk. Right. And um, you can collect the pieces. Oh, I have the quilt from the last quilt walk. Do you want to see Oh, it? yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's like an Easter egg hunt of pattern parts? Yes, it is. Oh, wow. Now, if you don't get all the pattern parts, can you make your own pattern kind Absolutely. of thing? Will they all yeah. work together? Or me and I'll get you take care right, of it. Right, I'm just gonna come in under the long arm here for some close up. It's the same pattern, just a little different placement. Mm hmm. Oh, and this one over here as yeah. well. Uh -huh. So, the only way you could get that, if you would come, you would last year, you'd go in the different shops, get the different pieces of the pattern, go home, and then put it all together. What a so, fun, fun idea! Well, my favorite thing is this not only do we have a great shop, we have a great downtown area. I mean, we have you know, shops, we have restaurants, we have a brewery, we have museums, we have, you know, all sorts of things. And I want to share the quilters with the downtown area and let them kind of experience being down here. So it's a way to kind of show the shops around here and the quilters, let them meet each other and have fun. What an amazing idea. Yeah, okay. this, this will be our fifth, no, sorry, this will be our fourth quilt walk. And I'm looking forward to it because, you know, COVID made us miss one. So excited to do that again this year. Well, okay. If I can get out here, I will. I'll put it on my calendar. I Better. appreciate that. Looking forward to it. Pretty amazing. Yeah. So this kind of brings us to the beginning of the video where we get to meet you in our shop. So now we somehow have to loop back around. We'll just put the video on repeat so we go behind the scenes all over there again. There you go. Yeah, you see the front end? Right. Like the retail component. And right. then you see the pieces that make all this happen. Right. And I think what's fun is you look at the shop and, you know, people might be thinking, oh, she has it all together. I have a great staff i have great support it, it's just a lot of fun getting to do this mm -hmm. and even the different components of it i actually really want to compliment you i don't know if you realize how many times in this little video you complimented your staff oh my staff is amazing well oh, i couldn't do it without them for sure yeah but we talk a lot about it making it fun the importance of the community spirit and why we all quilt together mm -hmm. You have been a long time inspiration to me. Oh. But it's because you're such a wonderful, genuine person. Well, you have great taste. Well, there you are right, of course. <laughs> but, and I know I'm getting a little mushy and stuff, but I really appreciate the fact that, yes, we, we, the quilting community, like to follow you, Angela, but Angela doesn't take the credit. She gives it all to her team. And this is what a great leader does. And I just want to thank you for being a leader. It's, it's, it's this guy right here. Who is this guy? This is Jeremy. This is Angela's husband and business partner. Is that a fair way of saying it? That is fair. Fantastic. And they are an amazing, amazing team. So fantastic. Once again, look at this. It was his grandpa that taught me how to quilt. So. Well, you know, when you're in front of the camera and people see you, it's easy to forget about all the people behind the camera right. that makes it happen. That makes the quilt walk happen. Right. I couldn't do that all by myself. So, That's yeah. Right. Wow. Awesome. Well, well great, thank right. you for having me. Thanks for being here. Of course. And if you all haven't caught our wonderful video we did a million years ago oh, when we were yeah. like 20 or something at a quilt market, a little chit chat yeah. away, yeah. check it out. I'll we put have it good at the back discussions. of this video. Good discussions about the industry. Love it. So, Love awesome. It. Thank you, okay. Rob. Thank you very much. Bye, everybody. Wow, you are still there. Thanks for sticking with me till the end of the video. <laughs> I know, I get a little long-winded sometimes. But if you did enjoy today's video, make sure you check out a few of the other ones we've created. I think they're terrific. And of course, please subscribe to the channel. Make sure you hit the little bell to be notified. I don't want you to miss a moment of the fun. Stay safe and happy sewing.